travel is more challenging now than it has been in a long time. A simple visa is replaced with piles of paperwork. Perhaps travelers can take a lesson in 2022 that exploring the world is a privilege. So, are you planning to visit Korea for a perfect getaway in 2022? Then, you have landed on a perfect place for all your answers. Hey guys, and welcome back to another exciting video where we will be talking about 20 must-visit places in Korea. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel before we start. So, without any further ado, let's get started. Korea is famous for being the land of kimchi, K-pop, K-drama, and 12 steps skincare routine and of course, its incredible natural beauty and landscapes. It is a diverse country for both city tourists and wild adventures. These 20 places are an absolute must, see for Korea travelers. This East Asian tiger is known for its phenomenal food to cultural sites to wonders of nature. Here are the 20 must-see beautiful destination in Korea. At number 20, we have Seoul. The dazzling capital city of Korea will be a great option to experience the beautiful Buddhist temples, neon lights, different palaces, and pagodas. It has one of the UNESCO World Heritage Sites, Changdeokgung Palace, which is a perfect place to enjoy authentic ancient architecture. Tea houses and shops of Insadong will give you the actual Korean flavors and Namsan Seoul Tower is a must-visit place to witness four distinct seasons and its impeccable scenic beauty. So, Seoul will be a fascinating place to witness both old and new cultures. Number 19 is Jeju Island. If you are traveling to Korea, then Jeju Island takes the top-notch position. It has a plethora of lovely scenery and fantastic recreational activities for visitors to enjoy. To witness the island's rich cultures, Jeju Stone Park is a great place to head on and the island also offers a famous waterfall, Jeongbang, which lies on the outskirts of Seogwipo. If you are a sucker for a traditional market, then Dongmun, which is a hub of fabulous street foods and dumplings and seafoods, could be a must-visit place for you. At number 18, we have the famous Yongju, a treasure trove of cultural sites. If you are a cultural lover, then this place is for you. Yongju is often called the Museum of Walls because it treasures many historical artifacts of the city. Best way to explore this golden city of Korea is by visiting Bulguksa Temple to witness the Buddhist culture and beautiful art, the Dairungwon Tomb Complex in Royal Tamuli Park to get the feeling of mummies and pyramids of Egypt. Korea has everything for everybody. So, do you want an adventure ride on your trip to Korea? Then next place is definitely for you. Number 17 is Seoraksan National Park. Seoraksan National Park could be a great place for wild adventure lovers. It is a great place to escape and enjoy the rugged wilderness. You can witness 1,562 species of wildlife within the park, which includes some of the popular species like flying squirrel, Korean goral, Korean musk deer, and others. Siorakan also provides visitors with a taste of culture and history, so it is one of the must-visit places in Korea. Next up at 16, Busan, a place with something for everyone. If you are visiting places in Korea, then not adding this place to your list would be unfair. Busan is an interesting amalgamation of skyscrapers, majestic mountains, beautiful beaches, and magnificent Buddhist temples, and it is amongst the best places to visit in Korea. The key attractions of this place are Haundai Beach, Biomiosa Temple, and enjoy the beautiful view of Diamond Bridge from the Gwangali beaches. Number 15. Dado Haihasang National Park, the largest national park in Korea. Dado Haihasang is one of the scenic places to visit in South Korea for its surreal landscapes. This place just looks like a slice of a paradise covered with large and small islands and unique rock structures. Hongdo and Hyuksando Islands are amongst the most famous islands where you can take a boat trip to admire its overwhelming natural sights. So, are you already excited? Hold your breath tight because 
other places are gonna be more exciting. Number 14 is Payongchang County, paradise for hikers. If you are an adventure lover or your love for hiking is too much, then Payongchang County will be the best option to consider. This place is known for its tranquility and its inspiring scenic beauty. This place will be an ideal option if you are planning a trip in winter to witness its snow-capped mountain and to enjoy outdoor activities. At number 13, we have Suwon, home to a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Suwon is known for its unique Hua Siong Fortress with its imposing stone walls and impressive archways. Another magnificent structure at the site is the Hua Siong Hangung Palace, which makes the UNESCO World Heritage Site a must-visit place on your trip to Korea. With all that said, don't forget to indulge in shopping in Suwon. With many more exciting things to do, Suwon is one of the top places to visit in Korea. Number 12 is Seongsan Sunrise Peak. If you are heading to Jeju Island anyway, then you should not miss watching the sunrise at Seongsan Peak. This peak can be a great getaway to witness the rare plant species with a spectacular sight of the sun rising over it. This could be a perfect place for nature lovers and hikers. Number 11 is Uleung Island Seaside Road. Uleung Island will be a great getaway for a tourist to enjoy some lush green mountains and emerald blue seas, but this is not the easiest place to reach. Anyone planning to walk or bike their way around the island should make sure they set aside enough time as there will be countless stops to admire the view. Number 10 is Jeonju. A place which gives you a vibe of ancient Korean culture is a must-visit place on your trip to Korea. Jeonju is a historic city and it's about 90 minutes by train from Seoul. They are preserved neighborhoods of ancient and old homes. Some of these homes are open for tours and others have been made into museums. This village is a great attraction for foreigners. Isn't Korea just beautiful? If you felt these places were great, wait till number one to be blown out of your mind. At number nine, we have Lotte World. If you were planning to spend a day doing fun activities with your kids, then Lotte World will be a perfect place for you. There's an amusement park and it also includes a hotel, movie theaters, one with the world's largest screen, a folk museum with traditional performances and other things to do like ice skating. Number 8 is the Korean Demilitarized Zone DMZ. Amongst famous South Korean attractions, one of the offbeat places that you can try is the Korean Demilitarized Zone. This place is a must visit for history lovers because it gives you a better understanding of the conflict between North and South Korea. You can take a peek into North Korea at the observation post and feel the rush of adventure while walking through the infiltration tunnel. It is advisable to take a guided tour that includes a visit to the joint security area. Korea is known for its food culture so you can't miss out on our next destination at any cost. Number 7 is Seoul Street Food Markets. The Gwangjan Market in central Seoul is truly a foodie heaven on earth. The large covered market area is filled with multiple food stalls offering the complete array of Korean specialities. Stalls typically offer mung bean pancakes, rice mixed with salty beef, vegetables and gochujang red chili paste, Korean sushi, and much more. So, it's like a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity that you shouldn't miss at any cost. At number 6, we have Chungwang Peak, the second highest peak in South Korea. If climbing mountains gives you the thrill, then this place stands higher on your list. This second highest peak also has a national park which stretches over three provinces. Standing tall at 1,915 meters, this peak is a favorite for many Korean mountain climbers. The clean air and fresh water from the spring will be a delight to your soul. Chungwang Spring and its dazzling flora and fauna makes it a must-visit place on your trip to Korea. Number 5 is Kaiyong Wa Station. Capture the essence of cherry blossoms. Who doesn't love a tree full of cherry blossoms? It's a treat to the eyes to see a place like a dream. 
Korea has Kaiwong War Station, and this place is quite a fair tale for the tourist. It is a favorite haunt for photographers who can capture the essence of the cherry blossoms falling down on the track and making a picture perfect moment. This place is perfect to capture the beautiful moments of Korea underneath the beautiful cherry blossoms. Number 4 is Gwangwamun Gate. This attraction is a giant gate, formerly the opening in the fortress wall to the Gangbokgum Palace located within. It is also one of the most visited places in Korea because of its unique structure and beauty. Gwangwamun Gate is home to the changing of the guard ceremony performed since 1469, which happens daily except Tuesdays at 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. A huge number of people pay a visit to this gate round the year and makes it the top most places to visit in Korea. Coming to the final three. Hyukjai Beach In your vacation to Korea, Hyukjai Beach is a must-visit spot if you are a beach lover and the sound of waves give you a hint of relaxation. This white sandy beach is perfect for families with its shallow water and camping in the pine forest surrounding the beach will be a fun thing to cherish your whole life. Hyukjai is also particularly known for its delicious abalones and conches served fresh in the seafood restaurants dotting the beach. Number 2 is Gongryong Ridge. Gongryong Ridge could be an ideal place for hiking enthusiasts and trekkers. The tourist comes to witness its unique dinosaur-shaped structure and to enjoy the sublime views of the surrounding mountain range. This place feels like a retreat to paradise with lush green mountain views and a clean environment. And for the number one place that we've all been waiting for, it is Bosiung Green Tea Field. Last but not the least, you can end your trip at Bosiung Green Tea Field. This place will be a great option for tea lovers as they can witness the beautiful Korean tea plantations. This place is also known for many K-drama shoots. Fresh green tea ice creams and green tea pork belly are the treats you must try if you are at Bosium Green Tea Field, but the spectacular view of the seemingly endless tea fields is the real reason that this place is a must visit on your trip to Korea. So, now you are all set to make your itinerary for your trip to Korea. We have curated the best of the best places to make your trip a blast and we have everything starting from hikers to city tourists to food and music lovers. So, when are you going to these top 20 places? From nature to the best of lifestyle and modern experiences, do what you love here and tell us about it in the comment section below. So, pack your bags and book your trip to Korea right away.